Well, I decided to come to UCSD Health because uh, UCSD has one of the best training programs in the country, if not the world. Believe it or not, it was actually one of my first interviews and I ended up canceling all the remaining interviews because it was such a great training environment. I thought I was going to get some good opportunities, but the doors fly open coming out of this training program, especially for electrophysiology. So we have broken down the program into a, a block of 12 months where there's a, a three to four months in the EP lab. They're gonna be uh, learning new things, uh, getting oriented to our workflow, and certainly you'll have uh, had less experience than the second year fellows, and they will, however, supervise you so that you can get involved very quickly in doing your clinical cases. And we like to have hands-on here where you get involved and take care of all aspects as you're capable, as you learn uh, of your patients. Primarily during our first and first year, we do half of our year over at the VA and half of our year here at La Jolla. Both campuses are, are very well equipped for our training uh, program. We have some of the, the best equipment uh, and the most technologically advanced equipment to learn on uh, as fellows, which as, as somebody who's training, that's what you want to come out here uh, being trained with. Very, very important as a trainee to feel supported by your faculty and how they progressively allow you to do more and more until you master each of the procedures that we nowadays do in the electrophysiology field. Dr. Mahmood has uh, took it upon himself to make this such a, a great learning environment um, from the fact that he's made this uh, a cardiac institute. Um, where everybody can come, and it's specifically for electrophysiology. We have some of the greatest names within uh, our division here. They all care for not only the advancement of electrophysiology, but the education of the fellows. So that makes our training environment here fantastic. Training at this program, research is definitely on the forefront of your training program. You, as soon as you walk in through the door, you are handed not only an opportunity to get on multiple papers, but also be the primary investigator of several different uh, ideas. So the research availability for the fellows here may range from anywhere from basic science, which we have a lot of colleagues on campus, to uh, clinical and applied the clinical sciences. So we have a lot of work being done in areas of new technologies for mapping, catheter ablation, uh, device uh, types and implants. The faculty here expect you to be um, uh, productive in terms of research. Everyone is very collegial, everyone is approachable, and, uh, and I never felt, uh, you know, worry about asking for a question. They, they are always looking, uh, looking after us and supporting us. One of the things that drew me to this program is the people. I love working with not only the staff, my co-fellows. I'm an advanced fellow and I, like, I love working with the general fellows here. I love working with the residents. Everybody's just very personable. The faculty's very personable. The lab staff is personable. And that was the one thing that drew me to coming uh, and working here. The relationship between fellows and faculty was always very professional and they are also very friendly and now I feel honored to also call them my friends. One thing I didn't realize until uh, completing, coming to near completion to the, the program is how well trained I was going to be and the opportunities I was going to get um, finishing the program. I got a lot of interviews to a lot of private institutions. Um, a lot of academic institutions. I was very blessed and I, I realized that that's not only because of my training here but because of the faculty here. They are very supportive.